Ah, the sweet sound of the cicada love song. We're going to be hearing a lot of the cacophonous calls of those 17 year cicadas, likely in the next few days. So only the males sing, and the females, they recognize the song, the specific song of their species, so they know how to find the males of their own species. Blame the noise on the men. Field Museum Insects Collection Manager Dr. Maureen Turcatel says be ready because billions or even trillions of bugs are coming our way, emerging from their longtime lodgings underground this week. 17-year and 13-year cicadas overlapping in some areas downstate. Some places are just going to be covered with them. It's there, there's no way to avoid them. You're going to be stepping on them. Some people say that sometimes they have to use snow shovels to take care of their sidewalks. At the Field Science Lab, Dr. Turcatel and others are are holding info sessions to teach people of all ages about the insects as more start to appear in the coming weeks. They only come out every 17 years. Including seven-year-old Lila Hamlet, who might consider becoming an eager entomologist herself. Do you think you're going to look at them? Yep. And I kind of take a magnifying glass. You're going to take a magnifying glass? Yep. But please, don't forget your pair of these. They're also giving out these earplugs so you can go into your backyard and look at your own cicadas without damaging your ears. Is that too loud? Over the next month, you can even learn how to add to your burgeoning bug collection at home, like the one Aisha Lewis started with her mother years ago. I have little baby brothers, so I want to create something new with them. You can see a full list of Cicada Field Museum events with this story on our website. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.